Hey, what's up, you guys? It is Stacey Bender. I'm Cheyenne. And I'm Sierra. And welcome back to this week's video. Today's something different. We don't really talk about K pop on this channel. We have before. We made a video where we tried to recreate iconic K pop dances. But, like, other than that, like, we really don't talk about it. I was like, we should make a video. Let's just get some background, okay? I've always known about BTS, but, like, I didn't really know who they were. I'd randomly hear their songs but again I never really found out about them that much so I never really went to go look for those songs that I heard or anything but then I found them again we both found them again when the dynamite song came out that kind of makes me sad because there are so many better songs than dynamite yeah like no offense like dynamite absolutely slaps but like their other songs are way better than that the fact that that's the reason why I actually like truly discovered BTS is kind of sad especially because it's like an English song and it was basically meant for it to be extremely popular in America. Yeah, it was like, I don't want them to feel like they have to become more Americanized or whatever just because that song did really well for them because I think that their other songs are better. But ever since then, we've been consistently listening to K-pop. I don't know what my music taste was before. It was kind of like really, you might even say cringe, old, old party music. I think that's my genre, you know, but now I just listen to big time Russian K-pop. Because I don't speak Korean, I don't know what they're saying in any of their songs. It's kind of like a mystery. What are they saying? What are they talking about in this song? I mean, sometimes you can guess from the vibe filter. You can kind of guess the vibe. Yeah. But the thing is, though, is that, like, in general, I don't know what they're talking about. Yeah. Because I don't know what they're saying. And so today we're going to be looking at some BTS lyrics out of context. Because if I was listening to an American pop song, if the lyrics lyrics were gross or like just weren't that good. I wouldn't listen to the song whether it was catchy or not. But I don't know what they're saying, so I'm just like vibing. Ew, ew I hate using the word vibing. Ugh. But I am always joking when I say it, I swear. So the songs that I decided to pick out for today are the ones that I think will make us the most uncomfortable because that's what we like to do on this channel. So I chose War of Hormone, What a Great Title, and Boy in Love. So those are the songs that we're going to be looking at the lyrics for today. They might vary a little bit from what it actually says in captions on the music video just because translations change a little bit, but yeah. it should be pretty much the same. I'm gonna be looking at this on Genius lyrics, so I guess let's get started. Start with War of Hormone. I'm honestly scared because this era of BTS I wasn't really familiar with, and when I saw that music video for the first time for this, I was kind of freaked out. It was like, wow, that's alarming. I have heard a little little bit of the lyrics of the song. Can't say I was too comfortable because literally everything makes me uncomfortable. I guess let's start reading, shall we? Because of who? Because of women. Because of who? Hormones. Because of who? Already. That just sounds a little bit nasty. It's just, I don't know. I don't know if it's just because everything makes me uncomfortable or if this is actually like uncomfortable. It's like because of women. It, it's like as a woman, like, I just feel like, <laughs> but am I still gonna vibe to this song every day? Yeah. Like, anything slightly related to, like, anything like that just makes me uncomfortable anyway, so we might as well just, like, really go in on this. So this is RM's first verse. It says, thank you for existing. Please call me. I'll buy you food. I think I'm crazy these days. Thank you for existing. Thank you for existing. You're a woman. I can see that. Date me. O obviously, we're joking with Again, this is out like, of context. It yeah. just sounds like very weird. Because obviously we all know that BTS isn't like that. They aren't. Well, at least from, not from our knowledge. And I, I hope not. Let's move on. Women wear things that make me cough, cough. See, see right through. See right through. Oh That's my gosh. That's why he's no! like, he's like this. That's that he can see like, through. Can we not normalize that? Like, it, it's like catchy for the song, but I don't want to be wearing something that, I don't know, that's why they joke, like, she showed her shoulder. Oh, sent to the principal's office. They were making the boys distracted because they saw your shoulder. It's like, I should be able to wear whatever I want and no one should be able to say anything about it because I can wear what I want. I don't dress for other people. I dress for myself. Here's the next line. Very much thank you for improving my eyesight. Don't need to spend money. I'll be in panic. I'll be a fan and I'll be a man of you, 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 babe. 
Oh, oh my gosh. This stuff just makes me want to puke. Like, oh my it's gosh. just like, I don't know. Like, some people are like, oh my gosh, it's BTS. So, like, it's it's amazing. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. But I don't care really who it is. I, anything makes me uncomfortable. It's just like, especially because it's a song, you know, your friend on your guitar, you know, singing to you, and you're just like, okay. Like, imagine your friend wrote this and he's like singing this to you to be like, what do you think about it? I'd be like, disgusted. But, but you know what? Because it's BTS, like, I give it the okay. Is that bad? Well, the thing is, is, like, the whole song is a vibe. The whole song is something else. The song is meant to be a certain way, you know it what is. I mean? I mean, it's literally but called War of Hormones. I mean, I guess technically, it's not their fault. Blame it on hormones. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> no. Blame it on you. Imagine if somebody came with their guitar and just, like, is doing this, like, I hate acoustic. I don't know if it's just me, but, like, when anybody does anything acoustic, I feel like it ruins the song. I know this is, like, a whole different thing. This isn't K-pop, but imagine if I'm I'm listening to Elevate by Big Time Rush. Do I want to hear Elevate a little higher <laughs> instead of like Elevate a little higher? I don't think that's the one I want to hear. Let's go to John Cook's verse. My eyes keep turning to the girls. Yup, women are like an equation. Us guys are the solution. No, I you're don't not like my that. solution, and you need to walk away. Better start walking. I hope people aren't like, oh, they're only saying this like as BDS. We aren't BDS haters. We are I really do like BTS. For most of my YouTube mixtape, I just think it's because it's any guy. It's just like, men scare me, genuinely. I don't know how to feel. I really don't. Yeah. It's just, I don't feel this way. So, so like, why are like, you? It's scary. Oh my gosh. It's scary. It says, wear the more, your high heels. I'm 18. I know what I need to know. The women are the best in the world. Yes, I'm a bad boy, so I like bad girl. Come here, baby. We're gonna hit it off. See, like, I'm listening to this and like vibing yeah, like, like da, 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 da. Ah! Uh, now i find out this is what he's saying excuse me jungkook like i'll ignore it when i hear it next time but like you know i'm like this like my fake casual dancing like this yeah, like, you know because i can't dance casually nobody can anybody really let's get to v's part of the song i really like this part of the song but also because it's like in english it bothers me because i know what he's saying hello 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 tell me what you want right now. Very Ugh. scary. Very scary. Demanding. I feel like I'm gonna get punched in the face. And then he says, hello, 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 hello. I'm gonna give it to you girl right now. What? What are you giving? It's really- mm -hmm. It's scary! Plus the music video, I just think it just makes it even more scary. They're just like chasing that girl. J-Hope got rejected by that cheerleader. He's like, get in my car. And she's like, no. And she walked away. Because we joke about this all the time. It's just like, oh my gosh, they're doing all these hand signs and then they're gonna hit me in the face. Because they're like- Because they're like- ah! And then they hit the camera. And, and then it's like, like, I feel like I'm being hit. And like, like, they're gonna look, jump me. They're running over me with bikes. And they're hitting me in the face. I'm literally gonna get jumped. Here's the next line. This is John Cook. Uh, you're not mine, but you're the best. My body twists and turns in front of you. What does that mean? Like, I'm confused. Like, like I'm twisting. Like, what does that mean? So if I'm walking down the street and he's riding on his bike from the video, all of a sudden his bike disappears. He matrixes in front of me <laughs> and then goes, what? Honestly, I'm sorry. I hope everyone knows what I mean by matrixing. When I say matrixing, I mean there, there's like a glitch in the system but like in real life as if somebody was glitching out as if they were in a video game but like in real life like people are gliding and stuff and like disappearing so he's just popping up out of nowhere his bike disappeared he's like gliding i hope that makes sense oh guess he can't walk now jim and his line is i want to approach you but you're seriously too beautiful well thank you that wasn't gross no that but... wasn't gross but also i hate this stuff <laughs> we just I just get uncomfortable with stuff. anything, honestly. I hate that stuff. I also hate compliments. I do. Unless it's actually, like, about, like, an achievement of mine. They're like, oh my gosh, you did such a good job on that. On that you know, video like, or something, you know? It's just, like, I think a lot of compliments make me uncomfortable, so I don't necessarily take them well. And I don't get many compliments anyway, but, like, whenever I do get a compliment about my appearance, which was, like, twice, uh, because <laughs> I literally look, I don't think that I'm that attractive. Don't. We're not even trying to be self-deprecating here. We're just we're talking like we're I'm not issues. trying to be that annoying girl who makes self-deprecating jokes. Who's like, oh my gosh, I'm so relatable. Um, like, no, but like really though. 
And so when it does happen, I think that there's something wrong. I feel like people are oh, pranking yeah. me. I like, feel I'm like not they're kidding. joking. Also, like, isn't that is that bad? Like when I think people say hello to me, I think they're joking. That's a whole another thing. Yeah. Um, I feel uh, like they're trying to prank me. Let's just do a little bit of these next lyrics, and then we'll move on. Making an internet grander. Women are the best. Best gift. Best gift. My, My one wish. true wish is only you. Only you. Okay, can we not? I feel like everyone's stalking me. You know what? Oh, this reminds me of like when you were younger and you're like, oh my gosh, I wish for Joe Jonas to be under the tree. Because <laughs> like, I want him to be my boyfriend. I can't tell you that that's not what I wanted when I was younger. I was like, oh my gosh, Jonas LA. Oh my gosh. Well, actually, you know, I wish for a robot of a Jonas brother. Because <laughs> you don't like, want the real thing. No. Uh, the next thing is everybody say, if it's you, I'm okay. Oh, I can't control myself every day. This is, that's the stuff that oh, like freaks like, me out. Like, what? like Men, that's why men scare me. The whole thing where they can't control themselves, like, really freaks me out. This is not to trash on men or anything, by the way. It's just, no. like, personally, I'm, I'm afraid. Some men are awful. We don't have to trash on them all the time. Like, some of those things are, like, really funny to, like, kind of laugh at and be like, wow, this guy did this. But I don't think it should be normalized to be even like, to men. Yeah, or be like, men are trash. You know what I mean? Great from the front. Great from the back. From your head to your toes. You're the best. See, like, uh, that's creepy, in my yeah. opinion. I mean, whatever you're thinking, that's on your own, but I don't need to know. Also, I don't want to go too far into the song here, but I do want to mention some of these lyrics. But honorable uh, mentions. It says, it's completely ridiculous. I don't care about women. I'll hang out with you once and say goodbye. Why? But I learn when I see what it says. My testosterone heavily shows up. That's what a, I hear oh they're like, God. oh, my testosterone. It's just like. I'm worried because are we gonna post this and nobody else feels uncomfortable? I don't know if we're just like innocent, but like honestly, I feel like I need to read the Bible after this. <laughs> this was the part that makes me confused because it says when she says she's not interested, it makes me dumbfounded. If she said no, she said no. Like I obviously I agree with that, but because it's BTS, I find it so funny. I don't know why because it's like I can't really imagine them being like that, so I take it as a joke. I'm pretty sure it is. I'm sure if they looked back on this, they would be like, oh. Wow. I just, I don't know. I wonder what they would say about it. I'm just curious because obviously their music style and their whole look has changed so much over the years. Yeah, it's become more soft rather than like a rock. It was a bit more rocky. Well, there was like bad boy, schoolboy vibes. Yeah, I don't really know how to describe it, but like it's not like they would be even be able to get away with that today, dressing up like a schoolboy. When you're like 26 years old. <laughs> but their whole look totally changed. We're starting with boy and love. I I guess let's start these lyrics. Yeah, also, I don't think that these lyrics are gonna be as bad as yeah. the other one, so we might not have to yeah, use it. It's much. not gonna be as nasty. nasty. Our, uh, great start. I want to be your opa. I'm so hungry for your love. I want to be your opa. I'll have you just watch. That's still scary. That sounds right. like so good, like when it's in Korean. Draco, ba, na, ba. But like here, it just sounds scary. I don't know. I don't know. Men are just scary. I don't know. I don't know what to say anymore. There's no excuse. I have nothing to say. V sounds really good at this part where he's like, why are you shaking up my heart? Why are you shaking up my heart? Like, that part. <laughs> like, that sounds amazing. I love, that's like my favorite part of the song. The first verse I find very kind of funny in a way. Again, like a lot of the stuff is just like, I think that they would even think it's funny. Like, dad, just how exactly did you ask mom out? Should I write a letter? What is this? I become like dust in front of you. That's kind of funny. Like, why are you Think about how your dad asked out your mom. Jacob sounds really good in this song. RM sounds good. I'm just gonna skip through. Like, now, the chorus makes me uncomfortable because I did hear about the chorus before and it just makes me like squirmish, makes me want to gag a little bit. So I'm gonna recite it. Hold me tight. Oh my gosh, I don't want to say it. Hold me tight. I'll say it. Hold me tight. Oh, why can't I say it? I, oh Hold me tight before I kiss you, before my heart lets you go. Say what you want, say what you want. What is it that you really want? That's enough. Honestly. Also, in the music video, they have that girl and they're practically bullying her and pushing her they're around. Like, ah! Remember like, that one? Looking, shaking her. Yeah, remember that one part? It's like, dun dun dun. dun. Yeah. It's like, I would so, never want to be her. That's scary. No. The thing is, in all the comments, everyone was saying, like, how jealous people would be of her. And I was 
was just like, nah. And so when I saw this one comment saying that, like, I would not want to be treated like that, even if it is BTS. Like, that's just so weird. It doesn't matter who it is. Guys just make me uncomfortable. Even though I'm straight, I don't know what else to say about it. So it's just like, I... No. No. Also, I feel like, you know how, like, she kind of just seemed helpless and being, uh, helplessly being bullied? And, yeah. Like, the whole like, music video on there saying in this verse, a bad girl on the outside and even more bad girl on the inside. What? That, she was, like, practically helpless and she innocent. Looked, she looked innocent. She looked like an innocent schoolgirl just, like, walking <laughs> along. Oh my gosh. If you lose a guy like me, <laughs> you'll regret it. You checked my message, but you're not pressing send. Sorry. You're kind of simping. You know? Like, <laughs> I don't want to answer. Maybe I'll buy a GPS navigation? I uh, don't know about this. Am I being tracked down? Stalker, stalker, stalker. I don't know. I'm scared. I don't understand. They said that they were being teased by her, but, like, they were teasing her. But that was just understand. a music video. Literally. Sure, like... The song compared to the music video is so different. Like, literally, the pre-chorus is, I'm getting nervous. Why do you keep teasing me? Just stop now. Hold up, hold up. Right? So, like, it, they're just thinking that, like, in their own head. Like, yeah, they're like, I'm not shaking her around and uh, she's closing her me. in in she's front of me. a locker. She's literally teasing me. How dare she do that? How dare she reject me? No, 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 no. I think everything we said in this video was a joke. I really like these songs. They're bangers, they're bops. Obviously, not a lot of it is well translated into English, so maybe yeah. it's slightly different in Korean. I don't know. What did we learn today? Guys make me uncomfortable and they need to stop. I'm yeah. just kidding. No, facts. I'm no. just kidding. Okay. I can't Ever, believe that this video is going to be on the internet. Like, I can't believe that. So I guess that's us getting uncomfortable over BTS lyrics, because I guess we're too innocent for this world. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. If you like our channel, you might want to go check out our gaming channel. Yes, we do some gaming content. We're doing some fun stuff over there. Our gaming channel, link in the description down below. Um, By the way, we will have a pinned comment and we'll be asking you some questions down there. Uh, so you can answer us or you can just put whatever you want in the comments. Thanks for watching. God bless you. Have an amazing day. We'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.